over 300,000 tons of waste is generated daily in Addis Ababa, according to estimates. Three quarters of this comes from households. Garbage collection in the city is currently carried out in a traditional manner. But Lydia Asrat and her fellow computer engineers feel they can change this by developing a waste collection application. So the idea here is to um, deploy the IoT technology uh, towards bringing a, a cleaner environment into Africa. So WASIEP is zeroing in on sub-Saharan Africa, so we want cleaner streets clean, um, in Africa. They are creating a sensor that can be placed inside a waste bin to monitor its status, then alert collectors when it is full. We built a prototype device uh, that is connected to the waste bin. Uh, this device is made of some microcontrollers, electronic components, uh, so that we can send the data we got from the waste to our uh, API. And the second major part that we added for this project, it's a SMS gateway, uh, because once the bin is full, we, we have to let the uh, waste collectors, uh, let them know about uh, the waste, so they can get the notification easily through our own get, uh, SMS gateway. Users will install a waste management app on a smartphone and register the type of bin being used and the garbage likely to be disposed of. Not only will that allow the real-time monitoring of the bin, the information will also be shared with garbage monitors. We're targeting um, an ultrasonic sensor for our bins so that we're able to see if the waste bins are full or not. That data gets captured from our API into our dashboard. This is the dashboard that we built for the administrators. So you can see that the administrator can look at the sensor, can look at a live data of the sensors. Once the bin is full, the bin owner and the garbage collector will receive notifications and the rubbish will be picked up immediately. For now, the team has just developed a prototype, but once the sensor is fully developed, they hope city administrations in the continent will adopt the application to help make their cities clean. Koleto Anjohi for CGTN in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.